Hello, hello, hello. Welcome, welcome. How you guys doing? Today I wanted to share with you my experience farming relics in Honkai Star Rail. There is a lot of saying that you always have to be farming relics, you know, just using all your energy, even refilling, just, you know, people at the beginning of the game, they were just burning all the energy and stamina just to farm relics. I haven't done that. I've been taking my own pace, I've been building characters, trying to level them up, trying to increase their traces, uh, trying to get their light cones leveled. That's what I've been doing mainly playing the game, and I have the proof for that. Because I've been playing this game since release, and my energy uh, has never been <laughs> like it never reached to either 180 or 240. I always use my energy in the game, so like I'm I'm playing the game, but I'm just not farming relics. And the proof for it is this achievement that I just got today. Um, <laughs> I've only farmed relics 400 times since the game release which is not that like that number is not that big um i can show you this by showing you also my relic inventory it's really let's go with the rarity i don't really have that many relics that's it and the rest i'm just gonna like salvage them because they're not that good right now so i just didn't do this and uh yeah that's mainly my inventory box for the relics and most of these relics that i use on the characters are crafted because something in honkai that i really like is the fact that we can craft the main stat that we're looking for yes the item is very valuable i think it's like one of the most valuable items in the game which is understandable because you can just get the like granted main stat that you're looking for so mainly i had like for example, my Jingliu, which um, has an ice set, um, like for example this boot, I crafted this because I needed speed boots and I couldn't get it by farming. I was like, huh, don't waste my energy just to craft it. I got lucky with the crit, it's not the best, of course. Crit damage, I didn't have any crit damage as well, I kept getting defense and HP. I was like, hmm, let me just craft it and that's it. Like the uh, the body and the uh, the gloves are easy to get, so I didn't really craft them. You just get them easy. So what I've been doing since the game release is just wait for this event, where it gives you the option to play a relic stage like this. Go here, select the stage that you want, which is for me right now. I'm just trying to get a follow-up set, so I go here, select the stage, just go and beat it, and it gives me guaranteed almost four to five pieces which is not bad i've been using that i've been doing that since the game release and the rest is just me crafting relics <laughs> i'm gonna show you my inventory after this um like to show you the characters that i have built not fully because of course there are characters who still require me to go and farm relics but i haven't been struggling with the content I will show you that with the content that we have, like Memory of Chaos, Pure Fiction, I've been able to do 30 stars or like whatever we have now <laughs> without any issue. Like I w I'm not struggling uh, with the gear I have, okay? So yeah, let me skip this and I will show you the relics. Alright, so just for the sake of the video, let me see what did I get here. Of course, HP boots, yeah. Yeah, defense, I love this. Yeah, come on, give me, give me more. Uh, I don't know, I might save it. But yeah, let's now, let's now go to the characters who I, I have built, right? So, my Jingli, it's not the greatest. Like, she can gain more crit damage, especially that she has a light cone. She can gain more attack. Um, Ruan Mei, she can definitely gain more... Um, stat maybe speed <laughs> funny my brodia she's her relic set is so random don't even ask like i have this on her for hp just to make her like survive and just not care like i don't like she has the crit she has some speed she's doing her job i'm fine with it same thing for who who just slap some hp um 
like I think the characters like I feel like I'm okay using is Jing Liu. And I think Den Hong and even Den Hong is well built. Like he's on full musketeer. He still need more crit um, on both. Especially that he also has the light cone. But I'm just running musketeer, which is almost like probably all of it is crafted except these. Like I got these the crit damage and the rest I just crafted it. Actually, I didn't craft this. This was natural piece. But I um, let me see what did I craft for him. Actually, I don't remember I crafted something for him. But, <laughs> like, Blade, for example, he still needs a lot of work. Like, my Blade is really bad. <laughs> so, yeah, Sile, she has a lot of speed. She still needs more work. One of the characters I f feel like I got really lucky for getting relics was uh, Hanya. She has 175 speed, which I really like. So, yeah. Um, and the content, let me share with you, uh, like, for example, Simulated Universe, I have finished uh, the mode, I can complete the conundrum, I just don't have the time, I think I'm on conundrum 6, yeah, I can do it with the remembrance easy, without even, like, you know, uh, bothering much, but yeah, uh, Swarm Disaster also finished, 100%, and Memory of Chaos, and... MOC, sorry, Pure Fiction and MOC, see, 12 stars, 36 stars, I'm not really struggling with the content, I feel like I'm enjoying it, like, I feel like it's challenging not to have, like, the best relics, I would love to have the best relics, I just feel like, for me, it's valuable more to level up the characters, enjoy multiple teams that I can play, like, for example, right now, I'm just trying to build all the 4 stars remaining, you know, so I can... You know, let me let me make a video on Hook. Let me make a video on Wind Den Hong in the future. If we have a content related to single target, he can be something good to use. Especially that I have <laughs> a really good Wind set for him, but I just don't have the time to like you know max it out. But yeah, I will definitely try to build a good Wind DPS. I know um, Black Swan is on the corner, but I just <laughs> I don't know. I will just hold on that for a Sharon. But yeah, that's my experience with the relic farming. Let me know how's your experience uh, with uh, farming. Are you enjoying farming, like rather than building characters? Um, but yeah, I appreciate you all for supporting the channel. If you consider leaving a like and subscribe for the daily Honk historical content. Thanks again for watching. Stay safe and bye.